Hello dear students, welcome to my channel. I am Ganesh. So today I have selected topic for discussion is classification of malnutrition. So classification of malnutrition is another very important topic for a examination point of view. You can expect one question from this classification of malnutrition. Okay. So without delay, we will continue with the discussion of classification of malnutrition. Okay. So what is malnutrition? Malnutrition is a pathological state result from consumption of excessive one or more nutrients or deficiency of consumption of one or more nutrients okay so that is nothing but a malnutrition if you take excessive nutrients that is also known as malnutrition if you consume less uh, nutrients that is the deficiency of nutrients that is also called as malnutrition okay so broadly malnutrition is classified into undernutrition and overnutrition okay so over nutrients overnutrition means the person when consumes more amount of nutrients than the body requirement it is said to be over nutrition if a person consumes uh, less amount of nutrients for the body requirement than the body requirement it is said to be a under nutrition okay now other classification of malnutrition you can see here so other classification of malnutrition is syndromal classification classification by indian pediatric academy okay and next one is glomes classification okay so first one syndromal classification Syndromal classification means it is a classification of malnutrition based on the group of signs and symptoms that is based on the syndromes. So it is classified into Pashuvarkar, Marasmus and Marasmus Pashuvarkar. Okay. Next classification is classification by Indian Pediatric Academy. Okay. According to Indian Pediatric Academy, uh, malnutrition is classified into normal. Normal means when the weight for the age is more than 80 percentage, it is said to be normal. When the weight for age, age percentage is between 71 to 80 percentage, it is said to be grade 1. If it is between 61 to 70 percentage, grade 2. 51 to 60 percentage, grade 3. And if it is less than 50 percent, it is said to be grade 4 according to Indian Pediatric Academy. How to calculate weight for, weight for age percentage that I will discuss later. So this is the classification according to Indian Pediatric Academy. Next one is Gomez classification. Again, Gomez classification will consider the weight for age percentage okay if the weight for age percentage is more than 90 percentage it is said to be normal if the weight for age percentage is between 75 to 90 percentage it is said to be grade 1 or mild malnutrition if weight for age percentage is uh, between 61 to 75 percentage it is said to be grade 2 or moderate malnutrition if weight for age percentage is less than 60 percentage it is said to be severe or a grade 3 malnutrition okay now how to calculate weight for age percentage okay because both classification okay either indian pediatric academy or gomez classifications they consider the weight for age percentage and based on that only the malnutrition is graded okay so how to calculate weight for age percentage so weight for age percentage is equal to actual weight of the child divided by expected weight of the child into 100 so this is the formula for calculation of weight for age percentage so weight for age percentage is equal to actual weight of child divided by expected weight of child into 100 okay how to calculate expected weight of the child expected weight of child is equal to age into 2 plus it okay so again the expected weight of the child depends upon the age of the child if it is less than one year and uh, more than 10 years it will differ from age uh, according to age of the child okay now i have taken example of expected weight is equal to age into 2 plus 8 okay so we will take an example and try to make a classification of a uh, malnutrition okay suppose a child has come to the hospital whose age, age is 4 years and when you measure the weight of the child if the actual weight of the child is 12 kg okay a, four, a child has come to the hospital and when you ask the age of the child it is 4 years and when you measure the weight of the child it is a 12, 12 kg okay that is the actual weight of the child okay now how to calculate the expected weight okay what is the weight of child supposed to be at 4 years that is nothing but the expected weight what is the age of the child at 4 years what is the expected weight of the child at 4 years so expected weight of the child is equal to age into 2 plus 8 okay now what is the age of the child is 4 years okay into 2 plus 8 so that is a 16 kg okay uh, the expected weight of the child is 16 kg okay but the child is having only 12 kg now calculate the weight for age okay so when you calculate the weight for age weight for age is equal to weight for age percentage is equal to okay actual weight divided by expected weight into 100 okay what is the actual weight of the child is 12 kg and what is the expected weight? 16 kg. Okay. Child is having a 12 kg at the age of 4 years. It is supposed to be 16 kg. Okay. So actual weight divided by expected weight into 100. Okay. So that is nothing but a 4 3 is a 
फोर थ्री जा फोर फोर जा ओके फोर वन जा फोर ट्वेंटी फाइव जा सो दिस बिकम्स थ्री इंटू ट्वेंटी फाइव ओके थ्री मल्टीप्लाई ट्वेंटी फाइव सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज ओके सो दिस इज अ वेट फॉर एज अकॉर्डिंग टू अवर कैलकुलेशन सो इट इज अवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज नाउ विल सी अकॉर्डिंग टू गोमेज क्लासिफिकेशन इट विल बी हियर ओके इट विल बी हियर सेवेंटी फाइव टू नाइनटी फाइव परसेंट इट लाइज हियर इन बिटवीन द सेवेंटी फाइव टू नाइनटी परसेंटेज सो अकॉर्डिंग टू गोमेज क्लासिफिकेशन इज अ ग्रेड वन माल न्यूट्रिशन और माइल माल न्यूट्रिशन सेम कैलकुलेशन इफ यू फॉर इंडियन पेडेटिक अकेडमी इट इज सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज सो सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंटेज लाइज समवेयर बिटवीन सेवेंटी वन टू ट्वेंटी एटी सेवेंटी वन टू एटी परसेंटेज दट इज ग्रेड वन माल न्यूट्रिशन ओके सो अकॉर्डिंग टू इंडियन पेडेटिक अकेडमी एंड गोमेज क्लासिफिकेशन इट इज अ ग्रेड वन माल न्यूट्रिशन ओके और माइल्ड माल न्यूट्रिशन ओके सो दिस इज अ वे ऑफ कैलकुलेटिंग द वेट फॉर एज परसेंटेज एंड क्लासिफाइंग द चाइल्ड और ग्रेडिंग द चाइल्ड अकॉर्डिंग टू गोमेज क्लासिफिकेशन एंड Classification by Indian Pediatric Academy. Okay, so in the examination, they may give uh, they may the questions comes like uh, the child age is uh, this much child age is, suppose child age is two years and weight is eight uh, eight kg. So like that the question will come and you may ask to calculate the weight for age percentage. This type of question may come or they may give a child age and weight and they will ask you to classify. Uh, grade the malnutrition as per the Gomez classification or grade the malnutrition as per the Indian Pediatric Academy. Okay, or they may simply give uh, the weight for the age percentage of child is sixty two kg or sixty two percent. Okay, the weight for age percentage is sixty two percentage. What is the uh, grade of malnutrition as per the Gomez classification? So they may uh, ask questions such as such, or they may give grade uh, this uh, weight for age percentage. They may give like a seventy two percentage. Okay, and what is the grade of malnutrition as per the Indian Pediatric Academy? So they will ask, and they will give options: grade one, grade two, grade three, or grade four. Or they may give options like a grade one, grade two, grade three, or none of the above. Okay, or normal. Okay, so like this, the questions may come. If you thorough with this one, you can easily calculate and uh, classify uh, malnutrition as per the Gomez classification classification by Indian Pediatric Academy. Okay, so this is very important topic. So all of you. please note this uh, information and try to repeat it okay as frequent as possible thank you thank you very much okay so if you like this video please uh, press the like button if you if you are the first in the time visitors please subscribe and uh, press the bell icon and share to others okay so thank you very much thank you